the workday date is going very well. It's time for a plant haul. It is becoming a haul. Good morning, happy Monday. Welcome to another week of the vlog. I am loving having AC. If you're new or didn't see last week's vlog, I got my AC installed last Tuesday and it is the best thing ever because I wake up and I am like cozy in my bed. Oh, I love it so much. Starting the vlog on Monday because last week I actually did two vlogs because my week was just so busy and I didn't want to have like an extremely long vlog so I did a weekend vlog. Um, and now here we are. Happy Monday. I was going to work out this morning but uh, I was very tired from a long day of laying out in the sun yesterday and my calves are still very sore from going to the beach and walking on the beach on Saturday. So... I do need to do something, so I might just do a little at home yoga flow toning workout before I have to go to work today. What a cozy start to the week. <laughs> okay, I decided instead of doing my like normal yoga flow whatever, I'm actually gonna do a, one of the mad fit workouts on YouTube. I've honestly never done one of these before, but I'm doing the low impact full body hit workout, no equipment and no jumping, so. Let's see how it is. Oh, we got sweaty. That was a good workout. I don't know why I don't do those more. Yes. All right, shower time. Just got ready as fast as humanly possible because I needed to leave for work a minute ago. I made a smoothie to take with me. I'll show you it when I get there, but I gotta go. I made it. Dripping. Dripping in sweat. So much for being clean, but at least I have a smoothie to cool me down. Got one class coach, then I have a coach meeting, then I might have to go walk the dog, and then just more Orange Theory. Monday's at Orange Theory days. And we're back. I have to say, I turned my AC off while I was gone because that's just a waste of electricity and energy to keep it on, but my apartment is still very cool. Like, I'm, I'm impressed by the insulation. <laughs> Um, well, it is just before three, so I need to figure out what to do for lunch, and then I really just have to go back to Orange Theory. It's too hot to walk the dog today, so. Honestly, I might leave you guys here because after work tonight, because if you watched the weekend vlog, the guy who I've been seeing, he came back from Florida, but his flight was like five hours delayed, so I didn't end up getting to see him last night. So he's coming over tonight, 
and I'm obviously not gonna vlog that because it's still very new. So if it continues, maybe someday you guys will get to meet him. But for now, this is where I will leave you guys for tonight. The rest of the day is just orange theory, so I will see you in the morning. Good morning, happy Tuesday. I've been editing all morning um, the weekend vlog because last week I just did so much and maybe I filmed too much of it, I don't know. Let me know if it's too much for you guys, but so I decided to split it up into a week and weekend vlog because this weekend was very busy as well, mostly Friday. Friday I did a lot. Just been editing that and watching some HGTV while I do it. And in like 20 minutes, I gotta leave to go work out. It's a benchmark one mile run today at Orange Theory. So we did like a prep for it a week or two ago and I did it in seven minutes and 42 seconds, one mile in seven minutes and 42 seconds. So I'm just gonna see if I can do like 740, take two seconds off. I feel like that is a good goal for myself. So we'll see. I am off my rocker. <laughs> no, I just forgot that there's no 1215 class today because they're doing maintenance on a bunch of the equipment in the studio. And I literally said that three times yesterday at the end of all of the classes that I coached. And I forgot that there's no 1215. Literally running out the door and I looked at the schedule to make sure there was room in the class for me. And I was like, huh, where's the 1215? Why isn't, oh. So now instead I'm gonna go walk the dog. If you're new, I walk this cutie little dog in my building. There are so many, um, ballet people walking around. I'm at Lincoln Center. There's definitely a performance happening here. I think maybe tonight. Um, but so many girls in buns and guys and girls in tights. And it's giving me PTSD to my Trina days. <laughs> but look how cute Zoe is. Hey Zoe. <coughs> Zoe. Come on. I am so excited for lunch. Last night for dinner, had some fried rice and General Tso's chicken. And there's so much for leftovers and I'm so excited. Mm. There's just something about fried rice that is so good. If you're still watching, comment down below what your favorite Chinese dish is. I definitely have to say I love fried rice. Like, if I had to pick one thing off the Chinese menu, I think fried rice would be the one. Yasmin and I are weathering the storm to go work out in Soho. <laughs> We're the true committed ones. Oh so cool! Yes, mine is on. Has so many words to say. It's benchmark time. Your and Escalator life for the wind because I already can't feel my legs. We're back at Yasmin's. We both showered. And look at how sweet Oliver is being. Oh, he's such a good boy. Yes. I love him. I love that all of my friends have doggies. Third meal in a row, not even mad, and there was even so much that Yasmin got some. <laughs> Oliver trying to snatch a piece. Good, how are you? It's cheesecake wow, time. Second fucking dessert of the day. <laughs> we deserve this. We earned this we cheesecake. Earned this. That was it. Look at Oliver, he's being so good. <coughs> he's staring right at it, but he's being a good boy. Let's see. I'm having the mocha. Not oh, bad. I am not the biggest fan of cheesecake. So it's like, even the best flavor won't be like my favorite. But it is nice. I think this is where I'm gonna leave you guys for the night. Cause I am 
email the Falling asleep. May wake up in Yasmin's bed. <laughs> we'll find out in the morning. <laughs> Good morning, happy Wednesday. So as you can tell, I did not wake up at Yasmin's. Um, it's like 7.45 in the morning. I wanted to come back and sleep in my own bed. It's just like easier. I'm going to work out, so it's, it's just easier. Before I work out, my legs are so sore. Actually, it's really just my left leg. I have not been taking proper care of my body. After the run that I did, I did an almost six mile run last Friday, and I definitely did not like stretch and do what I needed to do after. And then yesterday, like pushing it on the tread for the one mile run benchmark, my legs are feeling it. So this is my tiny little foam roller, it actually. I got this I got this on Amazon years ago and it goes in here so I have like this one that's like a little a little more intensive foam roll and then this is like a soft foam roller we're gonna go with this one right now Ooh. get the glutes get the IT band get the hamstrings we'll be feeling good and ready to go work out today IT band right right out here. This is where your IT band is. Oh my god, it's tight. And let's go work out. Breakfast time. Just made a little spinach and egg scramble because I don't really have anything else to put in it. So today, I'm just gonna be editing most of the day. Actually, the guy that I've been seeing is gonna come over and he's gonna work here. We're gonna be little like co-workers for the day. So I probably won't vlog too much, um, but I'm just gonna be editing so it's not like I'm gonna do anything exciting anyway. So I'll probably see you guys on the dog walk. I'm just gonna have breakfast watching some Shelby Church on YouTube and I will definitely be showering before he gets here. So I'll see you guys later. It's a hot one and Zoe is not having it. <laughs> um, the workday date is going very well. He's at the apartment right now on a call. It's been fun. And we're in the glowing orange lights. The good thing is I already did the workout today, so it makes it much easier easier to coach after I've worked out or done the workout because I know like what everything feels like so I can even better push people. Woo, woo, woo. Two classes and then I'm off to Williamsburg for the night. <laughs> Guys, this day date thing, Working together, we were both so productive. I feel like this is definitely gonna become a, a regular thing. I'm not mad about it at all. <laughs> all right, let's go to some classes. And we're done for the night. Headed to Williamsburg. <laughs> Good. 
Good morning from Brooklyn. On my way to Lena's apartment because I was in here. So of course, if I'm already in Brooklyn, you best believe I'm going to see my bestie. And we're seeing my king, of course. I made it. Howdy, y'all. How to do? It's me, Weenie. <laughs> and her son, Henry. That smile. Look at that smile. <gasps> He's come to say hello. Hello, Henry. Do you like a boop? No? No boop today. He just wants to play. This is the best part. Two people in one day. My Brooklyn peeps. Time for the doggy walk. Walk with the doggy. This will be my first dog walk of the day because later, in like an hour and a half, I get to walk the dog in my building. So much puppy time. Heading back to the city to go walk the dog in my building and I have yet to visit this L Train Vintage in Bushwick. It's gonna happen, it will happen. But anyway, it is a gorgeous day. I don't know what this outfit is, but it's keeping me somewhat cool in this Just a casual Thursday walking the dog with a concert at Lincoln Center. Finally back home, done with the dog walk, done with all of my commitments for the day. So I think I'm just gonna edit this vlog for the rest of the day because it's already Thursday and I have done none of this editing. I'm excited to not have to leave my apartment anymore. Just stay here for the rest of the night. What time is it? It's 4.30 already. What a day! So I made some dinner. I had the perfect amount of white rice left over from dinner Monday night. And then I just added a can of black beans and a can of kidney beans. This is gonna be like three meals right here. Three to four meals. Hell yeah. Delicious on a budget. I've said it before and I'll say it again. This is like... If you don't mind leftovers, like eating the same thing multiple times, it is much more cost effective. And this is my go-to easy, easy meal. And then I'll just add some shredded cheddar cheese or you can do like some Mexican blend cheese. Pop it in the microwave, you're good to go. I cannot figure out this lighting right now. It doesn't look, I mean, it doesn't look bad, but it's not like a beautiful meal, but it fills you up and it is wicked cheap. I've had a wonderful Thursday. Sorry I didn't show you guys too much of it. The first half of the day I was with the guy I'm seeing, so. But it is about 8.30 and I have work very early in the morning, so I think I shall see you guys in the a.m. Good morning, happy Friday. It's just about 6.30 and we're at Orange Theory. Ready to coach. We are done with work, done for the day. I am now at Starbucks. I got some food and tea because I'm meeting my friend Patrick and he's taking me food shopping. But I forgot to have breakfast before I left for work and I am very hungry now, so I just got a nice little sausage, egg, and cheese. Oh, look how big this Starbucks is. I'm upstairs. There's a whole downstairs section. I'm um, between 27th and 28th on 7th Ave, right across the street from FIT, the school. Oh. I'm excited to get plants. I'm hoping I can like get them back to my apartment today because I'm trying to film an apartment tour video on like Tuesday of next week because my sister is coming to stay with me. So fingers crossed we find plants and I can get them home today or this weekend.
we've we've made some choices. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. Only ended up getting a little tiny one because that big one was $125 and we ain't that bougie. We are not that bougie yet. Also, yes, yes. Patrick, I never officially introduced Hi. you to the vlog. This is Patrick. What's up, y'all? He used to work at Orange Theory with me and then he left me. Goodbye. <laughs> but he knows a lot about plants and works at a plant store, so he's helping me today. LOL, Patrick being dog obsessed. I got a nice hanging one and then another little one that I added to the bag that I will show you when I get home. Now all that's left, I'm gonna go get a palm as a nice tall one from the sill, which is where Patrick works. So he's gonna get me that discount. Time for a plant haul. <laughs> okay, heads up. Most of these I don't remember what they are, so I'm just gonna put little words on the screen when I ask my friend Patrick what they are because I already forget. So first, we have this hanging plant that will go in the window in my bathroom. Very excited. It's gonna get even longer and just like drape down and it's gonna be gorgeous. Then we have this little guy that um, Patrick said it will like close up at night and open up in the daytime, like in the morning. And this is gonna go on the shelf in the bathroom. And then next to it, I wanted something else that would kind of drape. So I got this little guy. That's in a hanging thing right now, but I'm gonna put it in a pot and it'll drape down the side. <laughs> Guys, I'm so excited. This other one that I got at the last place, which is the sill, which is where Patrick works, and he got me that discount. And they were able to pot it there for me. Oh, you're dangling down. I don't know if it's supposed to dangle like that, but this pot, is this not the cutest thing? And look at how gorgeous, so many colors. This I'm just gonna put on my window sill. I think it is so cute, I love the pot, I'm obsessed. And then, the big mama. Okay, there we go. Now you guys will be able to see it. I'm pretty sure it, it's called a cat palm. And I got it potted there so I don't have to do anything. It's all set. Is this not perfect? I really liked the more like palm look and it's gonna go right over here. I'm so excited. I spent probably about $200 today on plants, but I mean, Come on, I'm obsessed. My apartment is finally coming together. Now all I really need is art on the walls. And it is becoming a home. <laughs> oh, it's perfect. Yeah, well, we'll get a plant stand for this pretty lady, but I am obsessed, like. I'm in love.
I'm almost done with walking Zoe and I almost forgot to show you guys how cute she looks today. Who's the cutest? Where are you going? Look at that. Oh, look at that adorable face. Oh, hello. I love this dog. It's a poppin' Friday night. <laughs> Just having some rice and beans for dinner editing the vlog and watching my lottery dream home on HGTV. <laughs> and my palm! <laughs> now honestly, I'm, I'm kind of tired. I don't know why, but I'm kind of tired today. So I'm happy to just be chilling at home. So this is where I shall leave you guys for the night and I will see you in the morning. Morning, happy Saturday from the glowing orange lights. We got our Starbucks. I either didn't set an alarm or it just like didn't go off. So I woke up at 8 a.m. 30 minutes before I had to be at work to my calendar alert reminder of like 30 minutes before you have to be at work. So luckily we made it here. I would have been here on time, but I stopped at Starbucks and they were very slow now that like the world is picking up. It used to be I could just walk right into Starbucks. There was no one in there. Now there's a full on line, but I needed food. So let's coach some classes. Howdy. Done coaching. Howdy y'all. Lena came and took my last class and now we're gonna go down to Washington Square Park and get a delicious Ladies lunch. The I'm glad everyone's looking at their phones and not watching us be ridiculous right now. Did a little retail therapy. And I'm wearing my <laughs> Pete, The quick change <laughs> at Urban Outfitters. I literally manifested. I was saying at lunch that there were these jeans that I've wanted and I've been trying to find, and they had them at Urban on sale. It's a wonderful day. Only your luck, I will say. <laughs> I do have pretty good luck when it comes to sale items. <laughs> Not gonna lie. We back home. Um, okay, so. Right as we left getting food to go to Washington Square Park, I had my camera with a strap on it. The strap like somehow came loose and I dropped my camera. Luckily the lens is fine and the camera still works obviously, but look at what happened. Can you see the crack? I don't know if you can. Uh, I can't tell. But anyways, the screen is cracked so i'm hoping because i got this camera from the canon refurbished site i'm pretty sure it comes with a one-year warranty fingers crossed that's the case because otherwise i'm gonna have to figure out how to get this screen fixed because it ain't cute anyway gotta go walk the dog in a couple minutes and then i'm just gonna finish getting this vlog edited to get it uploaded in the morning because I might go out tonight, but if I do that, there's no way this is going to get up tomorrow if I try to put it in the vlog. So just follow me on Instagram because I also post a lot of polls. I posted polls about the plants on Instagram. I've posted so many polls about my apartment set up on Instagram. So just follow me on Instagram to see stuff that I don't put in the vlog. Let's go walk the doggy. Go Zoe, get it! Oh. <laughs> oh Zoe, you are the cutest. <laughs>